guys, it's Ms. Mint here and welcome to episode 3 of The Sims 4 Love Island. So guys, how are you today? I'll tell you something, Johan is doing amazingly. <laughs> he's like walking up these stairs with his little cropped up on knowing that he's got two of the four, there's only four? He's got half of the villa's girls under his belt, literally. He is romantic with both of these. I feel so sorry for Kelly because he's coupled up with Kelly, right? I don't even know the couples, damn it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's coupled up with Kelly, but then, you know, I don't think he actually likes Kelly. He's more of a, he's more of a Brooklyn guy. So we're going to see how it goes. Kelly is sat over here. She's a, she's having a bit of a spruce up because she, she, she likes Johan. She's got them little butterflies and she wants to see where it goes. So she spruces herself up before heading to bed. Oh jeez, <laughs> this is so awkward. Jo Johan's just like, um, um, which bed do I go in? Do I go in with Kelly? Do I go in with Brooklyn? Where do I go? He seems to be trying to sleep with Chris. I don't think he knows that he's meant to be sleeping with the person he's coupled up with, but you know, <laughs> you know, Johan, whatever throats he boat. So let's get him to come and sleep by Kelly. Actually, play by the rules for once. Kelly, but. What are these Sims doing? Just, just sleep in the correct beds, please. That's all I'm asking. Oh, jeez, I am moving my microphone. That is not good. Right, can we please just sleep in the right beds? Thank you. Sierra, what are you, who's Sierra coupled up with? Sierra's coupled up with Chris. I need to write these down. <laughs> I have no idea. Sierra, please jump in there with Chris. Aiden is coupled up with... Brooklyn? Aiden and Brooklyn are together, but they're in different beds. But, you know, that isn't too bad because we have also got Deontay and Shelby in the little hideaway for the night. Why aren't you going to sleep beside her? Can you not? Surely he can, right? He's friends with her. Yeah, okay. Th no? No? Okay. <laughs> He's going to be... He just wants to be a gentleman, you guys. He's going to come and have a nap on the sofa. So, I think that's the couple sorted out, right? I, I don't don't know. Right, so in the morning, it is 4.20 a.m., so I say in the morning, but I actually mean in a few hours. Can we, Chris, lie in the bed? You are romantic with this girl. You know what, Chris? You know what, Chris? <laughs> Just come and sleep on the sofa. And my game is frozen great. Oh, jeez, where are we going? Come and sleep on the sofa if you're going to be like that with your little towel right around your waist. So, as I was saying before, Chris rudely interrupted. Um, In the morning, forward slash, uh, like, we're going to say around 8 a.m., um, I'm going to announce, oh, jeez, let's ignore that reminder on my iPad. Um, I'm going to announce who will be leaving the villa today. In this episode it's sad you guys it's sad and I don't want to see this person go I don't see anyone go but oh look they're finally all asleep but I had to do it and to be honest it wasn't the, the vote was pretty close like the percentages I think it was something like 54% and um, so it's roughly 50 50 so there isn't a, so there isn't too much difference so it was 54 and 46 <laughs> making sure they add up to 100 uh, no it was 54% and 56 I'm pretty sure I'm pr it was something like that it was it was it was similar. what did I just say 54 and 56 no oh, that's right <laughs> Katie I'm trying to backtrack one was 54% the other was 46% um so it was pretty close still there wasn't like a specific favorite character where everyone's like yes definitely get rid of this one or definitely keep that one it was it, it was it wasn't too far off so is it 8 a.m yet no it's 6 55 come on <laughs> i want to announce the results come on game come on at uh, 7 7 a.m right, okay everyone's starting to wake up eventually um as soon as they go to sleep they wake up deontay he's feeling pretty energized about it i think he oh 8 a.m 8 a.m let's pause that conversation there so, the results are in, and I'm going to tell you, like, the exact figures, not the percentages that probably aren't correct. <laughs> so, the results are in. One person, or, wait, no, first of all, who was up for eviction? We had Shelby up for eviction, which is over here, and we also had Sierra up for eviction. So, we had two of our lovely ladies up for eviction. Um, so, one of these got voted 81 to leave so 81 people wanted this sim to leave 
another one got voted 69 so 69 people wanted the other person to leave now I'm going to tell you who got the most votes. I'm going to press play. <laughs> it's not even 8 a.m. It's not even 8 a.m. It fast forwarded. Um, I'm going to tell you who is leaving the villa ready. Drum more, please, everybody. Do. It just feels so tense. It's the first person to leave. Round of applause. The first person to leave The Sims 4 Love Island video. Love Island video? Love Island villa um, is Shelby. Shelby! <laughs> Shelby! No! So Shelby is, she's looking pretty happy now, cooking up a mac and cheese, whatever that, whatever that is. But unfortunately, Shelby is going to be leaving us today. Shelby, 81 people wanted you to leave. Sierra, 69 wanted you to leave. Shelby, I'm sorry, but we have to admit right there, Sierra, she's kind of got something going with Chris, where Shelby, I think that might have been what swayed it. At the end of the last episode, Shelby and Deontay, she just was like not having it. She was like, Deontay, back up, <laughs> go away, Deontay. So, you know, that might have been what swayed it. I don't know, maybe she just wasn't wasn't the favourite overall. Maybe maybe Sierra is the favourite. We never know, right? So let's uh, let's uh, let's let her eat her mac and cheese and then we'll make her leave at twelve AM. We'll kick her out the household at twelve AM. So meanwhile, Johan <laughs> is he Oh no No Johan, I know it's Johan. Is it Johan? Or oh, I'm sorry, I know I'm saying it wrong. Johan, boy, that is bad. You better wake up before she does. She's she's starting to stir. If Kelly wakes up, because I swear he went to sleep with Kelly, but he must have bed hopped over to Brooklyn. If Kelly wakes up and sees this situation, she's just gonna be like, what? why how why what <laughs> what is happening johan since when were you covered up with brooklyn so we're gonna get johan to wake up because he's realized what he's just done and maybe maybe uh, let him uh, have a little cheeky morning skinny dip in a hot tub and <laughs> let's get shelby to join him i mean last day better get the most out of it um no we're not we're not gonna do that we're not gonna do that we're just gonna wake kelly up maybe shall we wake kelly up or oh. No, Brooklyn, Brooklyn, you're getting up. And you, my friend, are skinny dipping as well. Woo, yes. <laughs> right, okay, let's uh, let's get her out here. Uh, press fast forward and get some skinny dipping going on. I, I kind of want Kelly to catch this. But then I also don't, if you know what I mean. I don't know. <laughs> right, I don't know. Let's uh, let's get Johan and Brooklyn to woohoo. Because, you know, it's all about these two woohooing right now. Where? Do I have a baby in closet? Oh, <laughs> I was like, what? What? Why can't we do this? No, we're not going to do that. We're going to woohoo in the hot tub. Because these two, uh, they might be in love. We never know. You, you, you see, Johan, he might seem like a bit of a... Bish right now he might seem like Johan is the biggest player of them all but at the end of the day oh what is this hello I'm nah I don't want any free earbuds my friend but at the end of the day <laughs> whoa where did they go um at the end of the day these two they might be the power couple they might be madly in love and johan he might just want to couple up with her for the rest of the series and be with her forever but, <laughs> as well as that, at the end of the day, he might be a cheating scumbag and he might just want a bit of both. So, we never know. We never know. Did he woohoo with Kelly as well? I feel like he may have if I check the stats. No, no, he didn't. So, he's woohooed with Brooklyn. He hasn't woohooed with Kelly, but he did have a bit of a kissy, if I remember. I believe so. Right. I think we're not going to wait till 12. Shelby, I'm going to remove you from the household shelby this is shelby's last screenshot she has beautiful eyes i love that color i'm so sorry shelby but you are the weakest link no wrong show katie wrong show <laughs> no you are leaving the villa ready shall we do like a leaving theme tune what shall our leaving theme tune be oh she's gotten up uh our leaving theme tune is gonna be do 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 yeah okay so every time <laughs> every time what am i doing every time a, a sim leaves a villa we've got to go do do well i've got to go because obviously you know i can't 
hey, but <laughs> you do 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 is the theme tune for us in leaving. So, ready, Shelby, do 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 do, and now I'm just gonna go and remove her from the household. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, guys, now Shelby has left the villa. I'm kind of nervous because I know now there's a chance one of the <laughs> one of them can get pregnant, and <laughs> I really don't want that to happen. Definitely not in this let's play. But I was considering whether we should evict another person, like do another vote and things, or whether we should do a recoupling. Now, I think a recoupling would perhaps be a little better to do but rather than doing it randomly with like a dice because then it's just like it's a bit pointless i think well i'm just gonna choose the couples which i think will be together so like who i think would choose each other okay so let's get them all to come and sit down here you know uh let's just say if you watch the program and you know how they get text messages let's just say that they've got a text message <laughs> and uh let's get them to come and sit on these little benches i don't know why i have so many of these i've just for some reason decided to plonk them on here i might need to uh, release this gate unlock it shall i say unlock it there we go um who can get there first it's like a little race but shelby has disappeared <laughs> i love the way deontay was just like upstairs here or wherever he was and like shelby just boom gone hopefully she doesn't try to visit us with us with her like knowing us where are you going where you're going to dance? <laughs> what? Boy, it's recoupling time. This is... Uh, I think this is one time that free will needs to go off. I'm sorry, <laughs> but there's no way all of these sims are going to stay on a bench without, like, the free... Look! Look, you see? You s I told you. I The free will just... It needs to be off for this moment. Sierra... Not Sierra. Damn it. Kelly, you're the only one that obeyed me. Right. Everyone sit down in your couple. So we've got... This might be wrong, actually. Kelly and Johan, I know they're together. Then we also have Shelby, and I know she was with Aiden. Then Deontay, you don't have anyone. And then we have Chris and Sierra, and, of course, Deontay on his own. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! Right, okay. I don't think anyone's going to, like, end up evicted from this. I don't particularly want anyone to get evicted from this. So we're just going to let them choose well i'm <laughs> i say let them i mean i am going to interfere and choose new couples uh, because otherwise we know deontay would end up getting dumped and i don't want deontay to get dumped so in fact we'll do a recoupling then i'll put another vote up okay well we'll see i'll just just go along with it <laughs> that's what i've decided to do so first of all we're going to let the ladies choose obviously because there's more there's less girls than boys so we need to let the girls choose wait we're missing someone are we missing Sierra? Yeah, I knew. <laughs> I thought we were missing someone. I was like, where have all the girls gone? Uh, because there's less boys and girls, like I just said, girls are going to choose. So, our first... Uh, <laughs> we're gonna let we're gonna let Sierra choose first, and Sierra she's obviously gonna go with Chris. So let's uh, let's get her to make a move on him. Um, then if we go over to Kelly, we've only got Kelly and Brooklyn. You know, not many people. We're gonna let Brooklyn. Now I think if Brooklyn was to choose, we're going in order, you guys. You know, not being unfair here. I think if Brooklyn was real, which is obviously a sim, but I feel like if she was real and this was a real life situation, you. Know, yeah. As they say on Love Island, on paper, Aiden is her type, but she doesn't want her eggs in his basket. She uh, she wants to be with Johan, and I feel like she knows that the only way to stay in the game is to actually be with someone that you know you can be a bit flirty with and provide good entertainment for so i feel like she is gonna go and steal kelly's men oh yeah she did that <laughs> and she is gonna just walk over and say come on boy the closet is waiting off they go which means kelly is now with aiden oh wait no 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 in fact Kelly, Kelly could happily, oh, she's going to be jealous, oh, 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 here she goes, here she goes, she's like, how dare you couple up with her, how dare, yes, yes, Kelly McQueen, you are a queen, 
Right, she's feeling very sad. Uh, drifting love, caught the love of her. Oh, the love of her life. No, Kelly. Flirting with another. Are they joking around or losing interest? Girl, he's not your love of your life. Trust me. So I think even though she's upset, if she had to choose between Deontay and Aiden... Oh, he looks a bit mad. <laughs> he looks a bit mad. What's up with you? Um, apart from the fact that his girls just ran off with someone else. So even though they weren't romantic. I don't know who she would choose out of Deontay and Aiden, actually. I feel like maybe she... Who does she have more of a friendship with? She doesn't really have more of a friendship with any of them. So he's Art Lover Creative on Flirty. He's Dance Machine, Active and Genius. Um, I feel like... He, Maybe she's more of a Deontay, I feel, or a, oh, <laughs> I don't even know who to choose. I kind of see her and Aiden looking cute together, but I think she's she's down for a bit of Deontay. I think she's down for a bit of Deontay. So, we're going to have Deontay and her couple up. I know that might not be the best decision, <laughs> but I'm going to think, because I feel like Kelly, she is non-committal, and she's a bit of a loner, so she's she's perhaps a little shy, um, so she is, she she's not really going to want to be with Aiden, because Aiden's a bit more out there, I think, whereas Deontay's a bit more, he's a bit more laid back, a bit more... Uh, pull his barrier up a little bit i don't even know everyone has got access to this now apparently so you know let yourself free um let's get oh she's gonna need to come and cry it out it's so sad he's off like in the cupboard with her she's just left alone oh girl and i think if i had let her choose first like if i had if she was first in the list down here she would have totally gone from johan you can see she thinks he's the love of her life and he's not and he's not if you watch the actual show this is kind of it's a little bit like in a way a bit like the at the very beginning the montana jess and dom situation where montana was convinced she really liked dom and then jess came in and stole him but then it's kind of not like that because dom didn't like mingle with them both i don't even know <laughs> i'm just gonna shut up now but she uh she needs to pee but she's also gonna cry because she's feeling pretty sad about the whole situation she just doesn't know what to do because johan is he's not being he's not being very oh sugar oh i was gonna say he's not being very comforting to kelly or he didn't tell her why he was gonna go but like about him in brooklyn but i've just realized i didn't click on brooklyn and make her use birth control so she she may be pregnant but gonna have to try it out <laughs> we're gonna have to try please don't be girl i've got it on a very low percentage i think maybe like 10 percent chance yeah she's not she's not that's good if any of them do end up being pregnant they're, they're gonna get evicted from the island i'm sorry but they're gonna be evicted because they can't be in here and having a baby it's not a very good environment for that i'm sorry it, but it's just not right let's like clean up oh was the shelby's no, it's not. It's Deontay's. <laughs> I was going to, like, feel sad then because I thought it was Shelby's. It's not. It's, uh, it was made by Deontay Dyer. But still, Shelby, we'll miss you, girl. We'll miss you. Aiden, well, I'm sorry, boy, but <laughs> look at these. Oh, oh, I love these two. Aiden's just a bit... He looks a bit mad, to be honest. He's a bit like, boy, I've been... I have been screwed over. Look, look at him. He's like, how, how has this happened to me? How has this happened to me? Um, yeah, you're, you're a bit single, mate. You're a bit single. Now, these two seem to be getting on quite fine. Maybe give it a little bit of a flirt. I want to work with these two, because I've not really been... <laughs> He's got friendship with the talking John. I've not really... Oh, she's... No, Sierra! Sierra, don't flop him off like that. Um, Let's try and bring this back, because you were looking very, you know, woo -hoo -hoo, a bit close, uh, and now you're looking very just far apart, complaining about love life. <laughs> He's going to be like, Chris, I have nobody. Chris, you're not the one. Chris, no. <laughs> He's just like, okay then, babe, I'm out. I'm here to mingle anyway. Discuss embarrassing mood. Yes. Share your feelings. Oh, good jeez. Stop moving the pop filter. You see, you guys, I just, like, recently brought this pop filter and I've not got used to ha having it. So, if in every video you hear me say, oh, damn it, I, uh, I moved my pop filter. Oh, <gasps> it wants to yell at her? 
What? Chris! No, but as I was saying, the pot filter, I'm not used to having it on, so I, I keep moving it by accident, so sorry about that. Chris, you can't yell at our girl. Sierra, Sierra, you should have coupled up with Aiden because Aiden seems genuine. <laughs> Chris, he wants to, like, snog you and then yell at you. That is, that is not very good, Sierra. Oh, jeez, this is a very dysfunctional household. <laughs> like, a very, very dysfunctional. What are these two cracking on over at Brooklyn? Let me know in the comments, you guys. Do you think Brooklyn and, um... And Johan are actually like, you know, like, yes, they are legit. Or do you think they're a bit fake? I, d I don't know. Who who should do Johan have gone for? Right. Oh, where are we going? Kelly, I need. Uh, are you sad? Oh, wait, no. Look at her makeup, though. That is flawless, girl. That is flawless. Anyway, guys, thank you all for watching. This is the end of the episode, unfortunately. Um, if you did enjoy, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I love to hear what to say, and subscribing really does mean the world to me. So, thank you all for watching yet again, and I'll see you guys next time. So, bye bye, guys.